Welcome to Morning Man with Pastor Steve Myrie. This morning's topic, God remembers you. Once in a while we may struggle to understand why God had not more rapidly answered our requests. Then we stumble upon a word that brings a stream into the desert. But God remembered Noah and all the wild animals and the livestock that were with him in the ark. And he sent a wind over the earth and the waters receded. Genesis 8 verse 1 The first four words were all we needed. Well, we still can quote them from time to time when we realize that God knows where we are and that he will get back to you in time. What peace, what joy, before Noah ran out of resources and provisions. He knows how much you have left in your reserve. Just before you ran out, God will send the wind to blow back the waters of impossibility and provide for you. I can't begin to describe the real ammunition that we can receive out of these four powerful words. But God remembered Noah. Sometimes there are some very simplistic reminders that tells us that God is still sovereign and then it brings great joy to our hearts. The comforting Holy Ghost calms our fears. He reminds us that he doesn't forget. When working with people, we often must remind them that we are still there. They seem to readily forget who you are or what you did. God doesn't. Don't confuse your relationship with him with your relationship with people. God says through Paul that it is unrighteous to forget. God simply doesn't forget. <laughs> he has excellent records. For God is not unrighteous to forget your work and labor of love which he have showed towards his name in that he have ministered to the saints and do minister. Hebrews 6 Verse 10, in the quote of the day, The Lord knows where you are, and he knows how much you have left in your reserve. As you go today, remember these words, that God remembers. And to our very special mothers, I say to you as well, God remembers, and Happy Mother's Day.